Let's find the difference between setting up our inputs and outputs, our buses, etc. on a profile and on an SXL. In the profile software, let's start by navigating our way to options and then to system. And here we have all of the information that we need to configure our show. We have 96 input channels, 8 effects returns and 24 graphic EQs. There are 24 buses in total. I can choose to have 8 oxys and 8 stereo groups, 16 oxys and 8 mono groups, or 16 oxys and 8 variable groups. The 24C that we're looking at is connected to a 192 engine, and you can see here it has 192 input channels, 24 matrices, 32 VCAs, 24 mute groups, and 32 graphics. To configure my buses, I go to the Mix Bus Configuration window, I click on Edit, and choose how many groups I need. Whatever is left over will then become available for oxys. In this case, you can see that I have 96 buses in total, 16 buses for groups, and 80 for oxys.